Yo, what's going on guys? It's Ghost RBX here. And if you guys are new watching this video just to see how to do this, then uh, make sure you subscribe because I'll be making a lot of videos on this and new, other new games. Um, so today, I'll be showing you how to get ice on snow shown simulator and pretty much all you can really need is snowmobile pretty much that's all you need um and then there's some other stuff that you need but you don't really need to worry about that um you just need to worry about snowmobile if you need you need snowmobile okay and here's the ice containers. This is the same thing, just recolored, same RV, same everything. It's a different guy, uh, different packs. Uh, these are your ice packs. You're gonna need these. Um, whether you're going to go mine some ice or you're not. Um, so this is the classic default one that I have on right now. And this one, you, as you guys can see, you could upgrade your packs as you go, but. When you do buy a pack, it costs money and ice. And so I'm gonna show you guys how you can get ice today. So when you come through that little tunnel right there, you're gonna see this, of course, and then you're gonna see Tim's tools. You don't really want Tim's tools to know from the store. These are all of your tools you could get for mining the um for mining ice. Um, they have different ones So you can definitely uh, Choose which one you want But the first one you have to get is the kitchen knife and so that's what I got And you need the kitchen knife um, Whether you like it or not in order to mine the ice so Let's come over here and this is ice. Ice is a uh, reflectant uh, ice material uh, part. And every time you should hit it, the ice should look like that. If it doesn't, then you're probably doing something wrong. Oh yeah, you can also get fire slides. If you guys have fire slides, that's perfectly uh, fine. Yeah. Um, but as you guys can see, your ice pack is going up. So if you were to, uh, uh, let's say, get your plastic, uh, Plastic shovel, yeah, and try and shovel this up. It wouldn't go because you need to have an ice tool in order to get ice. Um, <clears throat> so we'll, we'll stop at 30 uh, ice here, and I'll show you guys how you can sell the ice. Uh, exactly. So once you have that, you're gonna get back on your ice uh, snowmobile, and uh, you're gonna want to take a ride up to the top of the mountain. This, uh, the Game Pass guys, just to warn, the Game Pass is absolutely shit. Don't get it. I mean, I'm not, I'm not saying that it's shit. I mean, it's useful, but for 200, for 200 Robux that you could do by yourself, it's honestly not needed. So pretty much, I'll show you guys what this is. The mapping guide. Uh, continue. So absolutely, I do charge one-time fee for 200 Robux. For unlimited trips, blah, 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 you want to purchase this, continue. Sure, I'll pay the one-time fee. And it brings you over to the Mountain Game Pass, right? But when you have a snowmobile that goes 80, almost, almost 80 miles an hour, you could literally just fucking follow the path, right? You could follow the path all the way up to Mountain. I'll show you guys in a minute. Um, yeah, I have, you guys could literally just come right here and sell your ice, boom, $62. Like, that's all you need to do, honestly. It's not that hard. <laughs> so that's pretty much how you get the ice, guys. 
just a short little video on to show you how to get the ice. You do need the new snowmobile. Oh, we landed it. Shit. The cave, alright, so this is a cave that apparently has gold on it. And in order to get in the cave, if you don't know already, you need 20,000 ice. And it might seem like a lot, but it's really not. Because once you get, you know, a decent amount, or if you have the fire slides already, uh, or you could get the, uh, you get a, the lightsaber, uh, which I believe gives you, uh, it's Robux. I didn't know it's Robux, I thought it was shit. Alright. Oh. I get I'm guessing since there's more money it's gotta be better or I don't know, honestly. I'm not that good, but it's a big ass fucking saw though. Not gonna lie. I'm guessing I'm guessing as like you get more ice and money and whatnot, you can sorta of kinda get like Oh no, like, um, you get more, like, we uh, weapons. You get more tools to mine the ice. Therefore, you get, uh, a better, um, fucking, you get a better pack or a container, ice container. Uh, but you pretty much just want to keep doing that over and over again. Nothing, uh, big. It does, uh, I do suggest, I mean, if you have the money, get the dragon, the pet I got right here, because it doubles the speed of, uh, you, of your character chopping the ice. So, without the dragon, I would be going, uh, one, I don't know how, like, one speed, I don't know if that makes sense, but, I will be going, oh shit. I'd be going a lot slower than this. That's for sure. But other than that, guys, that's how you get ice on Snow Shovel Simulator. It's not a big uh, procedure. It does cost a lot. You do need 500000 just for the snowmobile. And then you're going to need more cash just for, um, for the pack and the tool. So it does require some money. But... If you if you guys been playing since the day it came out like me, then you should be at the top like where I am. Like I got 3.21 that million money, 5.2 million snow. Also, guys, do quest quest help your money. Uh, there's a lot of things to help your money out. Um, other than that, actually, let's take this up to the top. You can um. I believe you can actually. Oh my god. That's big. Okay, so we can't actually get up. Oh, I saw I saw a bridge over there. I'm kind of wondering what it was. Alright, well that's going to be the end of this video guys, if you guys enjoyed, please subscribe and leave a thumbs up, because I think this video will be very helpful to most people, especially when, especially since the new update just came out, so um, I'll see you guys in the next video, peace out.